calm before the storm. Then the drivers will look towards 2015. Probably a five second board. The tin tops are ready to go for the gear 2015. On go the lights, out go the lights, and away we go. Great start from Comedy, good start from Jordi Janain. He's come side by side already with Rob Half. And Jordi Janain gets the lead, does he? Do they touch? And that's not good. Oh, into the barrier at Reservoir. And the Reservoir dogs have taken by storm this race because... Huff and Janae have come together and caused mayhem again. Not sure who I blame for that, really. Uh, if anybody, here we go. And that's still Simon. There's more racing still to come for this. It's not over yet because this is the championship on the line. Comine versus Pepe Oriola. comedy has got the lead just. They touched for a moment. Incredible drama. Red flag. No surprise. Wow. Great start from Janae. Half tried to defend. Six of one, half a dozen of the other. Either way, it's Barrier City. Plenty of cleaning up to be done as well. There were quite a few cars involved in that. When you've got the cars right at the front of the field here at Macau involved, there's going to be quite a bit of damage down the order. And one, there is. One, two, three, four, five, six, seven, eight cars. No, what? Nine cars involved. Here we go. So look. Rob tries to defend. Janae's got the line ahead, but as he, that interesting. To be honest, I'm not going to blame Huff on that one because Huff actually had the racing line more so than Janae, who got a better start but couldn't go anywhere, had to come across on Huff, and that's what caused everybody else to concertina into it. But uh, if you look at the angles, I think I'll, I will have, I'd like to see it again, but Janae really had nowhere to go but to the right, at which point he then, you know, comes across um, Huff. And Huff, I'm sure, will say, uh, <laughs> you know, what do you want me to do? So very, very interesting crash and a very sad crash because uh, obviously Huff, the good news is, uh, if there is good news from something as uh, big as this crash, and before we get too far ahead of ourselves, uh, as the doctors are out on scene, let's hope everybody's OK. There's Rob Huff. He waves to the crowd and uh, is A-OK, -okay, but that's game over for him for the day. But then again, eight wins in the bag, and I bet you he'll be back next year to try to do the same again. Behind the Maserati safety car, which will peel off, and then we'll see the resumption of the top two in the championship. Stefano Camini and Pepe Oriola. And this start is going to be crucial, absolutely crucial. Getting up to speed now, Camini with Oriola behind him. 